Hello everybody, Mr. Storm here. Welcome back to the Horse Lord Mega Campaign in Stellaris. In the last episode, continued working on, well, waiting for our various mega structures to get built. Uh, mega art installations are making progress. We got to the completed Matryoshka brain, but there is still one more stage that we need to go through. Almost done, 100 days left to go. Uh, we were able to claim this neutron star system um we explored a wormhole and cleared out this neutron star system and we're currently surveying it so we'll get that here shortly and um yeah just kind of uh working our way along also waiting to get the plank photons we actually have the plank photons we need to, um, to create the Nickel Dyson Beam Wormhole Generator. Because I'm going to attempt to blow up this star. It's one of my own stars that I want to blow up, but, um, yeah, it's going to be a test firing to see how it works. So that's the plan. Hopefully it'll let me blow up one of my own stars. But, you know, we'll give it a shot. Pretty sure I was sending the loyal brood to deal with these pirates. Though the pirate fleet is significantly reduced in strength. And I think the Endagon of Sovereignty are sending a fleet to deal with the situation. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, they're definitely sending a fleet to deal with the situation. So I don't think the Loyal Brood is going to make it there. So you know what? You want, you guys just stay right where we are. The uh, Our vassal has that well in hand, so... Won't be a problem. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Oh, got three, all three research done all at the same time. Oh, that's interesting. All right, energy weapon damage. Mirror lifespan. Explosive weapon attack speed. Construction complete. Now, so Starbase has finished its construction queue. Ah, oh, yes, because I was building trade hubs. Because those are more important to me right now than uh, anything else. And, oh. Got something to take care of there. All right, let's take a look at the art installations. 774 days. Hundred eighty-eight days. 57 days. That'll be done here soon. 
And the thing that is really going to be interesting when it finishes is the EHOF Ultima. Two hundred ninety seven days. That is a lot of debris. <laughs> at the entrance of this thing. So I think the thing we're waiting for most of all is this to finish. 32 days. All right, just a month. System survey complete. All right, that other system is surveyed. And now I need a construction ship to head over there. That's you. Get all the stations built. I don't think I really need any more Neutronium Gigaforges, but, you know. It's nice to have those systems anyway. Four days. Three, two, and one. And complete. Matryoshka Reality Simulator is ready. It has been done. With the cost of some efficiency, our, our Matryoshka brain has been equipped with billions and billions of stasis pods, capable of holding a huge amount of beings. These beings will be able to live within a completely virtual world, free from the constraints of reality. Keep in mind that population grows extremely slow inside a virtual world and all possibly to be moved from another planet. Okay, that's that's fine. I think that actually reduces it. Scientific breakthrough achieved. So I'm actually not going to be running that any further. Give me defense platform hull points. All right. Let's see if we can blow up our own star. Nickel Dyson Beam Wormhole Generator. Well, it's going to let me build it. How fast is it build? Pretty quick, all told.
I'm guessing in theory you can build this in any system you control. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Energy weapon damage. Heal hit points. Seems like it builds at like 1% per day. Okay. Scientific breakthrough achieved. All right, there's our leader lifespan. Administrative capacity, sure. Uh, basically consumed most of our plank photons. It's all right. The Brill Entity has opened their borders. Well, that's nice. Breakthrough All right, what I got here? Defense platform, hull points. Give me kinetic weapon damage. Ninety-three percent on this wormhole generator. Alright, a warp gate has now been constructed near blank. It is only a matter of time before this entire system is engulfed in fire. Acknowledged. Is there anything I need to do to make that happen? Or... Fire. Eagle Dice Beam is firing through the warp gate. An entire solar system will soon be engulfed in by cataclysmic energies, ending everything within the star's gravity well. Marvelous. Do it. I want to see this bad boy fire. Second stage of Mega Art Installation is complete. Alright, just a second. Hold on. Pause, 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 pause. Okay, we're 
paused. I want to make sure that we are continuing Mega Art Installation. Calibrate Index has begun the construction of a vast long-range sensor array. Yeah, so be it. Alright, it's... It seems to be firing. You might want to get out of that system. It turned it into a neutron star. And yeah, it blew everything up. Oh. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Interesting. Now it's an unclaimed system, but it is surveyed. did lose the construction ship. Oh well. I mean, it's just the construction ship. Not the end of the world. Okay, well that is serious business. Because it did a little bit more than I was expecting. It actually severed the hyperlanes and everything. Well, let's scientific breakthrough achieved. Let's get a construction ship moving in this direction again. All right, I'm waiting to get this built. 19% And then what I'm going to do is try and jump the ship, because this ship would ha should have a jump drive. Jump it into this Avoy system. And see if I can reestablish things. Or at least reclaim the system. Get an outpost built there.
All right. Where are we at? 480 days on that. Seven hundred and thirteen days on that. A civilian convoy. Okay. All right, one day left until the Ultima is done. An astonishing achievement, the final addition to the facility gives those who control it total domination over micro, micro wormhole travel. Micro wormhole stabilization is 100% efficient and there is no limitation to the travel destination. Good. I mean, no fleet detected. <laughs> There's a massive fleet. People have traversed every star type, but we now have the ability to keep the connection open. We can choose the exact star we wish to travel to. So I guess if I choose one of these, I get to pick where it goes. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Construction complete. All right, that research station is done. Let's go ahead and jump you over here. Can now post built there. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Entry attack speed. Engine crash from jobs. Let's go for that. And explosive weapon damage. Armor hit points. All right, I'm going to need a science vessel. You. Actually, no. Well, you're going to be moving there anyway. Um, you. Move there. All ships currently in that system move out.
Oof. It is not like me having all those fleets selected. What I want them to do is to head back to the Ross 154 system. Okay, there we go. Means they'll still be in, you know, within reasonable distance to be able to respond to anything that's going on. Is that the, um, Zarklands Pilgrims, yep. Alright, they are out of there. Let's say I want to aim at Stellar Remnants. Oh, there still is the Juggernaut. Toggle the event horizon offset facility to create a permanent micro wormhole connections.
is preparing for travel. I'm not exactly sure what I was missing there. Maybe I'll just look into it a little bit more. I'm, I'm pretty sure I should be selecting a target. But we're going to fire a wormhole at a random system and we'll see what happens. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Well, whatever it is, is not obvious. Explore destinations, explore. I'm, yeah, I'm figuring out yeah, there should be a list here of of targets. Yeah, those are my explored destinations. Hmm. All right, well. I think we're at the end of the episode, so we'll I'll try and figure out more about what I can do with that before next episode. And uh yeah, we'll see we'll see what happens. Activated. Hold on. Is it actually firing? Scientific breakthrough Unless it's open.
Just a sec. I want to see what happens if I do this. Okay, well, not sure what's going on there. Construction. I'll have to do a little bit more reading on it, I guess. Alright, let me just get this all set up, and then we'll call it an episode there. Alright, well, yeah, we'll go ahead and stop here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.